Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to solve the problem number 1.36 from Irodo and that is related to kinematics. So let us first read out the problem and then we will solve the problem step by step. A particle A moves in one direction along the given trajectory with a tangential acceleration of W tau is equal to A tau where A is a constant vector coinciding in direction with the x-axis and tau is the unit vector coinciding in direction with the velocity vector at a given point. So this is the trajectory it is given in this particular problem and the velocity vector will always in the tangential direction of this particular trajectory. Okay, And in the problem it is given that the tangential acceleration w tau is equal to a tau where a is a and tau both are vectors. A vector it is along the x axis. So let us say this is x axis and this is y axis and tau is along the tangential direction. Tangential direction. So let us represent a vector as a is equal to let us say the magnitude of a vector is a and the direction is in the x axis so we can write it as i cap. Now if we talk about this uh, tau vector so tau vector we can write it as tau cap which is in the tangential direction ok. Now in the problem it is asking to find the, the velocity of the particle depends on x provided that its velocity is negligible at the point x is equal to 0. So when the particle was at this particular point that is at x is equal to 0, here the velocity is also 0. Okay. Now if we write the tangential direction of the acceleration, we can write it as a vector dot product with tau vector. So a vector we can write it as a times i cap dot product with tau cap ok. Now we can write uh, the tangential acceleration as dv upon dt or v dv upon ds where this ds is the displacement displacement along the tangential direction tangential direction ok so here it is in the problem it is asking to find the velocity of the particle that is depend upon x so better we can write uh, the acceleration in terms of the displacement instead of uh, in terms of time so let us write it here so the tangential direction of acceleration we can write it as v into dv upon ds is equal to a i cap dot product with tau cap ok and if we take a ds to this particular side then we can write it as v dv is equal to a i cap dot product with ds times tau cap ok so a i cap is the vector along the x axis and ds tau cap is the vector in the tangential direction ok so if we see here let us say this is ds vector then we can take the component of ds and we can write it as this is dx and this is dy. So we can write ds is equal to dx i cap plus dy j cap. Let us substitute the value of this uh, ds here then we can write it as so this is nothing but ds into tau cap. So we can substitute here we will get a i cap dot product with dx i cap plus dy j cap ok. So let us do the dot product we will get a times dx from here that is equal to v dv. Now let us integrate both the sides. So at x is equal to 0 the velocity it is given at 0 and let us say at the position of x the velocity is v. So from here we can write v square by 2 v is equal to 0 to v is equal to a times x, x is equal to 0 to x. So from here we will get v square by 2 is equal to a into x 
and then we can write v is equal to 2x under root okay so this is the velocity we got as a function of x i hope uh, the entire procedure is clear thank you